So, uh, Saxman, I'm, I'm sorry to see you in this state. <laughs> yeah. Tell me a little bit, what's going on, Saxman? Um, I'm being restricted by school. And <laughs> How on earth does that happen? School is such an open place. Well, there's a lot of stuff that we're forced to do. There's a lot of stuff that we're we're forced to learn, and we don't really have freedoms within learning those things. Okay, can you give me an example of that? So have you felt that right the way through school section? Through most of school, I mean like this class is a little bit different, but I would say for most of my classes, I've been told how to learn, I've been told what to learn, and I've been told what to present. That's very interesting. Yeah. So, this class, is a little different to that? Yeah, it is. In, in what way, Saxon? Um, well, you see, we have inquiries, which um, basically we, pish, we pick an issue, yeah. and there's freedoms and restrictions within those, but we're given a lot more freedoms than any other class I've ever been in. So, and What's that done for your thinking? Um, I think it's it's opened up my mind a lot, and I've, I've learned to think different ways. I've learned to think way more creatively, and I've been given that opportunity to think a lot creatively, a lot more creatively than any other class I've ever been in. Well, I have to say, the metaphor that you're using of the jail and the handcuffs, it's very powerful. Thank you. I think, I mean, obviously having the autonomy, would you have ever done this in another class section? Never. What made you think of this? Um, well, I think this semester hasn't really been a great semester for me in terms of grades, but I've been kind of frustrated because I've been thinking that um, in a lot of these projects, if I was given the freedom to do what I really wanted and to show what I really wanted and how I wanted to, I think I could have done a lot better and I think I would have learned a lot more too. Do you mean in your other subjects? Yes. Very interesting. Uh, if you if you had the power to do it, or let me rephrase it, if you could give advice to the public school system, yeah. thinking of the young people coming behind you and how you want their experiences to be, yeah. what would that advice be, Saxon? Um, I would say that I think we need to treat everybody as an individual and not have them as cookie cutter people. Everybody's different and I think that everybody learns differently and if we could figure out a way to have everybody learn the way that they learn best and the way that they want to learn, I think that everybody would be way smarter and we would advance as a race. You have a remarkable mind, young man. Oh, thank you. Don't ever forget it. Thank you so much. Hey, no problem.